timing for the adoption of technologies, it's, it's hard to measure because it really depends on the, uh, the applications that we see in the market. So it's not just technology based, but really applications that people are willing to, to buy. Some immersive technologies are already hitting the market. 4K television is happening this year. We see most of the displays that are announced this year are 4K capable and the movie studios and consumer generated content is already being captured in 4K cameras. So 4K, cam 4K happened this year, 2015. Next we'll see 8K. 8K will probably take another three years because 8K cameras are only now coming out on the market. 8K displays are being announced as well but that'll take a few years for adoption to occur. We need a full field of view to get all of the information together, not just what you're paying attention to, but also all the other information that you can selectively attend. And that means, by the way, you're watching a movie or you're playing a game and then you have a phone call. The game is automatically paused or the movie is automatically paused, so you don't even have to think about pausing the movie and answering the phone. You can make those decisions, but you can only make those decisions if they're integrated in a platform that provides that kind of integration. All of these technologies will make our lives better because it, they will enhance our cognitive abilities. If you look at search, I, 20 years ago, you wouldn't have believed uh, that you could have the information of the world at your fingertips. And today, we take that for granted. We take search engines for granted. We always go there, in fact, as first, first step. So in the future, with augmented realities, we would have exactly the same experience that we have now with search in the sense that we will feel empowered. We will feel that our cognitive abilities have been improved. No longer we will go to a new place not knowing where to turn. No longer we will go to a party thinking, I've seen this person before, I wonder what his name is. No longer we will, we will need to worry about those things and those things will be not only empowering but freeing us into do more things with our lives. Virtual reality are worlds that are computer generated, that are, that are meant to create new ways for us to experience new worlds completely. So we would be avatars in just those new worlds.